Like Wait a second. Hold on, hold on. You're on Tinder, and in your Tinder bio, it's a list for cleaning supplies that you wanted people to buy you? That's what happened? Yeah. There's something you illuminated to me that I had no idea, was, which was this concept of the fact that Bumble and Tinder, their Bumble was created by the girlfriend of the guy who made Tinder. It's something we talk about quite frequently on the show. Uh, so one of the things we, we, one of the stats we bring up is 20%, the top 10% of men on Tinder are getting 63% of the right swipes. The top 20% of men on Tinder are getting 83% of the right swipes. The top 63% of right swipes for women are the top 43% of women. So for women, it's a much more, much larger distribution. And for men, it just seems like a very small number of men on these dating apps are getting a ton of attention from women. You mentioned something, first off, well, the first thing I want to go over is the, the fact that like Bumble was a petty play by the, the girlfriend of Tinder. I didn't, I wasn't even aware of this. And you, that you were, you were, you were involved with Bumble. Yeah. <laughs> I thought, I, I thought people knew that. That's so funny. I hope I don't get uh, in trouble for. That for... makes me, I, firstly, Bumble's a better app. It's not even close. I don't use any of them anymore, but when I did, I thought Bumble was better because the women would reach out. So it actually like, even though a lot of guys didn't like it because the women ha the women had to make the first move, the thing is when a woman made the first move, you were just things were more likely to work out. So I actually liked it better as an app. Yeah, I, I don't use I don't use either, and I don't use either. But I'm actually banned from Tinder, which is so funny because not not because I help Bumble. I'm because I used to work. I worked with Bumble, and then years later, I was working with Tinder. Okay, I'm not. I, I, it, Whoever pays me more, it's who I'm going to It's what Dave Chappelle, which tastes better, Coke or Pepsi? He goes, which one, whichever one's paying me. Literally. It's not <laughs> people, people ask me all the time, Michael, what's the best club in Las Vegas? I'm like, whichever one's paying me. That's the, that's the best one. By the way, what Republic on Friday, everybody? Anyway, go ahead. Go ahead. What you say it. Yeah. I, you know, I'm, I hustle. I need to make money because I don't have a rich family to pay for myself or sugar daddy. So for sure. For me, Whoever pays me more is who I'm going to go with. Um, I'm a feminist yesterday, and I'm going to be not a feminist today if it's going to pay me better money. Yeah. That's just the truth. With the dating apps, obviously, there's yeah. extreme. Uh, with Tinder, I... <laughs> With Tinder, I even though I used to work with them, I've been banned for the app, from the app, which is so stupid. But it's because one time I was trying to do research about how, because somebody, I forgot for which episode for my podcast it was, but I was trying to do research about the fact that somebody said how you can, you can go on these dating apps and you create in your description, like a link to things that you want people to buy you. And then in, in, the, in the description, you write like, I would love to talk to you more if you buy me one of those things. I don't really recall how it goes. Oh, like tokens and or something like that. Like they do on Twitch where you can like buy subs. Is, is that what you're talking about on Tinder? Because the, the issue I've seen is girls, all, like every attractive girl I see on Tinder now is trying to get you to go back to their OnlyFans. That's why girls are, I see girls getting banned on there. Oh, well, it was, it was for items. But because I turned 30, I, I did an Amazon, Amazon wish list. But my wish list at first was just like cleaning supplies yeah. and expensive. Like Wait a second. Hold on, hold on. You're on Tinder and in your Tinder bio, it's a list for cleaning supplies that you wanted people to buy you. That's what happened. Yeah. yeah. So then it, that's not working obviously. Cause I'm like, okay, that's not sexy enough. I'm like asking for like a really cool gadget, like a uh, vacuum and this thing that really cleans your windows better. And like something that completely gets rid of any rust or anything like that in the bath. I'm like, okay, that's not hot. <laughs> Wait, this is, what are you talking, I know some dudes who think this is the sexiest thing they've ever heard of in their life. You're literally on an Amazon wish list, not asking for shit from Tiffany's. You want a vacuum cleaner and, a, and like a brooms and shit? That's incredible. Like, okay, not, not, to, not to be sexist, but I know some men who would be like, that is incredibly refreshing. No, so then I'm like, okay, I have to add lingerie to make it sexier, because then yeah. they'll be. To okay. go with the broom and, yeah, I got it. <laughs> So I added this different lingerie. And then in the description, I said, my love language is gifts. So if you buy something from my wish list, that's, then we can talk. And then I put all my hottest pictures and all my hottest pictures were yeah. professional. So I got, and then I did the age range for everyone. Okay. And I just kept talking right. So I literally just went and swiped right for everyone. That'll get you banned. Them. That'll get you banned for sure as a girl. No one, no one swiped right on me. So I'm like two days now just looking. I'm like, what the hell? And then I'm thinking, what if they think I'm a bot or a fake? Because people always, the reason I'm not on dating apps is because people always message me fake accounts of me. Yeah. So I'm like, maybe because I did professional pictures. Anyway, before I had a chance to even change that, I got banned from Tinder. Because wow. I think they were either a bot or uh, a fake account or, you know, looking for men to buy me stuff, which is what I was doing. That's so for great.
That's hilarious. So, that's definitely a, a TikTok clip. I don't know how other women do it, but it didn't work for me. 